Hi everyone, I hope you're well. So please excuse the lack of effort, but I've got to hit class later and I just, there's not much point putting makeup on and yeah, I've got my gym clothes on. But anyway, I wanted to do this video. I wanted to show you finally what I've got Violet for her birthday. She's a, a 10 in like two weeks time. It's crazy, time has flown by so quickly. And I feel like I've been meaning to do this video for ages, but just time and just, Something always crops up, but I've got time this morning, so I'm gonna make the effort to do it. And hopefully this will help you give you some inspiration if you've got a 10 year old or younger, actually, or even a little bit older. There's quite a mixed range of stuff here. Obviously Christmas is coming up as well. But she was quite adamant what she wanted for her birthday. So she is very much into her gymnastics. She's really good at it and she goes every Saturday. She enjoys it, it's kind of a, her thing at the moment. She's been doing it for a couple of years now. So she wanted a gymnastics bar. They um, do them on Amazon, eBay. I got one for her quite a little while ago actually and it's gonna go in the gym. Um, it's kind of like, I'll try and insert a little picture but it's basically an adjustable bar so you can adjust the sizing of it but it also kind of flat packs so you don't have to have it out all the time. So it's gonna be really useful. It's gonna encourage her just to progress in her gymnastics and yeah, she can just go crazy on it. So I've got her that, that was one thing she really wanted. And then we've got her the mat to go underneath it. So it's a kind of a turquoise bar and then the mat is purple. Again, I'll leave everything linked in the description bar, but I think they were roughly around 40 pounds each. So actually really quite affordable and it's something that she's just gonna really enjoy. So obviously this is just an extra few bits that I did get her so she can unwrap. So I got her some of these palm protectors, which are for the bar. It just protects the palm and it just, it's just helps with grip. So I got her those, they were about three or four pounds from eBay. And then I also got her this really cute new leotard as well which i think she's gonna love this was from ebay as well um so that's kind of the gymnastic stuff out of the way um i got her some slippers because she is a slippers lover these little slider ones i think these were from b&m they're kind of pink a little bit of glitter on um I also got her a diffuser. So I have a diffuser in the lounge, I love it. She actually loves putting my essential oils in it. And then I just thought actually, it would be quite nice to have one in here. She has a hamster and it does stink quite a bit. We have like plugins and stuff, but it would be actually quite nice to have her own diffuser. And I was just like searching around on Amazon and I came up with this one. It's got a really pretty box actually. This was, I want to say it was 20 pounds. Really, really affordable. And it looks so pretty as well. Um, it is glass, which is the difference between mine. I just have a plastic one. So yeah, I kind of got to be mindful. I can't get out of the box. Kind of got to be mindful with that. But then again, she is she's pretty good as long as she keeps it out of the reach of miles. I think it's going to be fine. This like mirrored sort of vase, and then. Um, you kind of put the water and essential oils in there. I think it holds 150 ml, which is pretty standard. Um, but it also has like timer buttons, which is really good. It's got like one hour, two hour, half an hour, and it just turns itself off. It's got the light as well. So when it's actually lit up, it kind of looks like this. It has a really, really pretty light up design. And there is loads of, um, reviews at how good this is it's a proper plug-in as well it's not a usb stick or anything so i think she's gonna love that um and it's gonna look really pretty in here as well so she's got that then i also got her some of her, her own essential oils so i actually went down the fruit essential oils so these are sweet fruit there is guava strawberry green apple passion fruit pineapple and fig these were i think these were 7.99 from amazon made sense to get her more like sweet scents because she some of them obviously the ones that i have she doesn't always like the smell of so these are kind of more like child friendly i would say so i've got her those to go with the diffuser she's also got this uh potions slime surprise i got this from b&m a little while ago she still actually quite enjoys slime i don't enjoy it myself like i don't enjoy the mess but she is pretty good with it and 
does it in the kitchen. So um, yeah, she's going to enjoy that because she hasn't had one of these before. There's a few different ways to make it and there's extra bits and stuff to put in it. Um, I got her this random card game from TK Maxx. It's called Kill the Unicorns, which is not the best name. And I was a bit like unsure what this game actually was, but it's for ages 10 plus. So it's her age range. I think it's just a bit of a fun card game. It's three to six players, 10 plus, And um, it was only £5.99. Apparently it's originally £20. But I thought it'd be a good game for like, obviously the kids are getting older, especially Alistair, he's 12. I thought we could play this as a family and it could be a bit of fun. So yeah, got her that. Um, I also got her some LED strip lights. We have these in Alistair's room. We finally put them up. I think he got them for Christmas. And they're kind of self-adhesive. They kind of stick along really, e oh my God, it, they were so quick to put up, but they are so effective. They absolutely love them. And Violet is desperate for some in her room. So I picked up this pack. Um, it's five meters long and it comes with a remote control. It has a sleep mode. Um, there's like different fades and moods and um, really, really fun. So um, yeah, she's got those as well. That's one thing she kind of really, really wanted as well. Um, she also wanted some of these really retro butterfly clips i had these as a kid myself i actually had like clear glittery ones and different colored glittery ones um i found these on ebay they're only a few pounds but yeah these little retro butterfly clips these are actually really good stocking fillers as well i think i'll probably end up getting her some more because they just break quite easily and they end up losing them and stuff but they're they're really really fun and then I got her a nail dryer. So she's got loads of nail varnish. She loves having her nails done. I don't, like, I'm not ready for her to have gel nails just because it's just not worth it, just because she can't wear nail varnish to school and stuff. So um, she ends up smudging her nails quite a lot. So I thought this would be quite handy. It's just literally a battery operated nail dryer. So she just dry her nails and just stick her hands like you would at a salon. And this was only five pounds from Amazon. So I got that. And then, lastly, I got her this little personalised necklace from Etsy. So cute. I did share this on my Instagram quite a while ago, because I bought it ages ago, because I didn't know how long it was going to take to arrive. And it was so speedy. Um, but yeah, so basically, it's a little personalised necklace. I'll try and give you a close-up of it, really. But it's basically um, a circle with violet and then a ten on the rose gold star and I think she's gonna like really appreciate that and actually wear it. I also think it's just a really nice touch because 10 I think is quite a big milestone They're going out of like the single digits into the double digits and I feel like they're just really growing up at this age. So I think that's gonna be a really nice sentimental thing to keep. Um, and then lastly, I'm just gonna show you some bits that she's gonna like gonna go towards like her birthday party as such she's having three of her friends over to stay um they're actually staying in the gym <laughs> so i'm gonna have to like move all my gym stuff out of the way but they're i've hired you've probably seen them advertised around or if you've used them yourself but there's a company that hire that you can hire like those cute teepees um and i feel like she's probably at the age now to do it and then she's just gonna outgrow that sort of stage so I thought it'd be really nice to do that. And um, you can choose like different themes. I've gone for like this floral rose gold theme and they set up these really cute teepees with like, I don't know, it's just all pretty and it's like a little sleepover vibe. So um, yeah, I've just got some extra bits to go with it. So instead of like party bags, she also does personalized water bottles. So I've got them coming. They were they've each got a personalized water bottle they were five pounds each which i thought was you know it's cheap compared to you can spend so much on a blooming party bag and it's something it's reusable it's something they can really use like take to school use at home whatever so she's doing those as well and bringing them um but i've, I've got the kids the girls some extra bits so i did go to home bargains and pick them up some face masks so they can do 
those these were only 69p from home bargains and there's two rabbit faces and there's two cat faces it's like a little it's going to be like a little like pamper birthday um i also got them each from home bargains a little lip gloss each so they can take home these were 99p each and they've got their little pom-poms on i just thought they were really sweet um i also picked these up from b&m these little necklace glow wands so they can have a little disco that's what i was thinking they can have a little disco they can we're putting the tv putting like a mini tv in there so they can watch a movie and have a movie night um so i'm setting up with like snacks um so i bought a big bag of sweets some monster mallows for their like treats i'm gonna do like pizza and chips super easy pleases everybody and then I also got this little bucket as well to put the treats in from B&M. This was a pound. I just thought it was really cute. I'm kind of going for like this, like girly dark cat theme. That's basically what I was kind of going for. Um, so yeah, this is kind of obviously lilac-y purple with the cats on. But I also got this cat balloon. Um, and also, how else did I get her? This boo balloon this was from b&m this one was from ebay this one was from b&m for two pounds it's like a halloween and then she's got a gold one and a zero obviously for 10 um we got some cat plates these were from ebay i thought they were so cute they kind of match match that face because obviously her birthday is like the 30th so it's like right on halloween so instead of going too halloweeny it's kind of more of a girly halloween that's kind of what i envisioned um and then what else oh cake topper I've got this really cute cake topper oh no i forgot about these actually okay uh, so other things that i've also added with the lip glosses um from etsy i found this lady that does personalized bracelets but it's like a diy so they make them themselves obviously i gave them the names of the girls and then they've literally got to make their own um bracelet but it's kind of halloween themed again i'll do a little close-up of these again i will leave obviously these etsy stores down in the description bar these are one pound 50 each which i thought was so affordable and um personalized cute so they're going to be they have like little trays at the front of the teepees so they're going to go on the little trays um what was i going to show you oh i was going to show you the cake topper so again i used an, a lady from etsy i think this was two pound fifty but it says happy 10th birthday violet and it's kind of gold glitter and then she's also going to have she basically wants a chocolate cake standard for violet she loves a chocolate cake pretty much the only cake she will eat and then we're going to have these as well on there on the cake topper quite grown up i think quite sweet i think she's gonna love that and these are reusable as well so i can reuse those again from etsy i think that is it i really hope i haven't forgotten anything but again i will try and leave everything linked um she's so excited i'm excited i can't believe she's gonna be 10 oh, it's crazy but yeah, it's going to be a super girly. I'm just going to let them get on with it. She doesn't want party games. She always said to me, she doesn't want, do I want party games, mum? But she she does want, one thing she does want, I need to get her some, obviously nearer the day, on the day, I'll get her some, she wants some iced donuts because she wants to do the donut game where you hold the donut and you try and eat the donut. We're going to do that, <coughs> set that up somehow with like four donuts in a row. Um... I have seen they've got pinatas in aldi i'm tempted to do that maybe and put the sweets in the pinata they've got like halloween themed ones um but yeah it's going to be a really fun day again i just can't believe like she has been here for 10 years like it's mind-blowing isn't it how quick the time's gone but um i hope this is giving you some ideas some inspiration i hope you're well i'll leave everything linked in the description bar and I will see you all very soon. As always, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to check out my birthday playlist because I have all the kids' birthdays in that playlist. So if you need lots of ideas, 
there's loads there from all different ages. Um, but yeah, stay safe and well everybody and I will see you all soon.